have lived it and gone through it. So I want to give you Max, mom and dad and the family to share a little bit more about what you guys are going to be able to do for the next in line. Hi, I'm Angelo Magdaleno. I'm Gabriella, and we're the parents of Maximus, our Shriner baby. Say hi. Hi. So um, I bet you couldn't tell that Max had the extreme scoliosis when all the kids were dancing. You probably couldn't tell him from any one of the other kids, and that's because of Shriner's Hospital. He had extreme curvature of his spine to the point where it looked like a third um, shoulder blade in the center. I mean, it was really very noticeable, and he was only, at that time, seven months. And so they had to do surgery because if, had we let it just keep going that way, it would have crushed, sooner or later it was going to crush the uh, arteries, some of the organs, I should say, not arteries, but organs. And so anyways, there was quite the emergency to hurry up and get a surgery, surgery going and getting that fi uh, fixed. Um, so we got that done here at Shriners Hospitals in Sacramento, and the whole experience from the beginning to the end was just, uh, they treated us so very well and welcoming, and uh, they made the whole experience not so, so much of a bad experience. They actually made it very bearable and tolerable, and just, uh, we can't say enough about how we were treated over here at Sacramento uh, during the treatment of our son Maximus. Uh, as you can see now, he just dances. Uh, we forget that he even had the, the problem. We forget that he had that uh, extreme uh, curvature of the spine now, because we can't, we can't even tell now. But I'd like my wife to go ahead and add to this, what I've just said. So we had um, Dr. Guthrie, was, which we thought was just a miracle doctor that said, you know, we had been to many specialists prior to going to Shriners, wherever our insurance sent us, and we didn't really have high hopes. We came and met the Shriners doctor, and he said, I'll fix him. And we were Dr. just, Gupta, yeah. Dr. Gupta, and he just made it sound like, oh, take a picture. And he did. He fixed him and we see him today. And it was the entire experience of Shriners. It wasn't, it wasn't just the excellent surgeon, it was all the staff. It was the OR staff singing the ABCs to my baby as he was being wheeled into surgery. It was incredible. I, you can never... They sang. Yeah. They actually sang, over, you know, to like calm him down and everything, and they actually, what did they sing, was it the, the ABCs. The ABCs, yeah. And the experience wasn't just to make sure that he's physically fine, it was emotionally, they, it's everything they do for the parent, for the baby, for everything, they care, it's from beginning to end. We can't say enough about it, it was incredible. We'll tell everybody who listens to our story of how great the Shriners Hospital is and the staff, the doctors, the, the miracle people. At one, at one point, my wife was so worried because they found that there was an anomaly in the blood right before surgery. And so she was like really, really just crying. And we both were, but she was really, you know, really, really crying a lot. And we're sitting there and three of the gentlemen from Shriners come along and they did some magic tricks and, and kind of took our mind off of the situation at hand. And then a few minutes later, someone comes out and tells us that, okay, we're going to go ahead and move forward. Everything's fine. We just have to double check, you know, make sure with the blood. And, but, uh, wow, we look back on that and it, that's pretty magical because at that moment, we so, so worried. And then they came out and these gentlemen, there's three of them, and they did like magic little tricks and stuff. And it did, it did what the trick because Gabriella, she kind of like smiled a little bit and uh, we're so grateful for the small things like that, you know. Yeah, it's just everything all together. We're really thankful. Thank you guys all for making this possible. Thank you. Would you guys please give this little guy a round of applause? 